A local hospital is the first in our region to use robots in the operating room to treat patients who need heart surgery. News 4's Doreen Gensler has a look at the cutting edge technology and how it's helping people get back on their feet quicker with a lot less pain and medication. It's miraculous. I got out of the hospital in three days. Hard to believe, but Brian Cohn just had heart surgery. The 64-year-old father from Northwest D.C. was recently diagnosed with mitral valve prolapse. It's a common condition where the heart's mitral valve flaps don't function properly, allowing blood to flow in the wrong direction. He says he went to several top cardiologists who all recommended traditional open-heart surgery. I was interested in alternatives that were less invasive. That's when he heard about the new robotic cardiac surgery program at MedStar Washington Hospital Center. When we do robotic surgery, we don't have to, you know, go into the middle. Instead, we make little small holes on the right side of the chest and where these robotic instruments go in and we can complete the task uh, without you know, opening the chest, which is a huge difference, you know, for the patient. Dr. Yuji Kawano heads the program and performed Cohn's robotic mitral valve surgery, the first in our region. Unlike traditional heart surgery, which can require surgeons to open the chest to access the heart, the robotic method allows surgeons to slip instruments through five tiny incisions, allowing for more precise movements unmatched by the human hand. This technique also reduces the risk of post-surgical complications like stroke, infection, and blood loss. Post-operative pain is going to be much less and uh, you know, recovery is quicker and then they don't have to stay at the hospital in long. And the lack of all that invasive uh, uh, surgery and incision means fewer complications, quicker recovery, less pain less pain, less pain. And I had maybe a couple of over-the-counter pain pills over the course of the next week to sleep through the night. And uh, other than that, I really didn't have any pain. For Brian Cohn, it meant getting back to his active lifestyle a lot more quickly and doing what he loves, while others would likely still be bedridden. If I'd had the traditional method, I'd probably still been in intensive care. Within 10 days, I went fishing with my son down on the Potomac River for his 27th birthday on the 27th. So now I'm four weeks out and I've walked three to five miles a day. And Dr. Kawano comes to MedStar Washington Hospital Center with a lot of experience in the field of robotics, having performed more than 200 robotic heart surgeries. In addition to robotic mitral valve surgery, the hospital says that robotics will soon be used to treat other cardiac diseases like coronary artery obstructions and cardiac tumors. Back to you. All right. Good That's deal. amazing, isn't it? George wow. Jetson. All right. The future is here. <laughs> That's incredible. incredible.